What's up, y'all? Welcome back. Thank you for being here, guys. Okay. Let's get some of these um, weekend energies out. This is going to be for water signs, okay? We're going to do water, earth, fire, and air. Oh, wait. Um, water signs. Let's see what's going on with uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. What's going on for Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces? I heard next 48, next 48, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Thank you. I feel a relationship or something. Authority, look, yeah, a relationship. Romantic love. Hmm. Somebody, or somebody says that they wanted to break up with you or something. Don't worry about it. Okay. Or this is you uh, wanting to break up with someone. Okay. Let me get one of these, please. Thank you. Hey, me too. Discernment, the light here. Mm. Authority, romantic love, and the reverse synergy, alchemy, consciousness, delight, and discernment. I saw two twenty two. What I'm feeling like is you gonna have to definitely put your foot down and sit yourself. You definitely is somebody who has gotten out of, of a relationship here. You took your authority back. You took your power back. You ended something. You you probably are in a new relationship. This could be a, a crusty ass fucking ex here up in your fucking business here, okay? But nonetheless, you've created something else, especially with alchemy and um, synergy here. You're going to be made aware that you're going to be very fucking happy in something you manifested, but you must use your discernment. Mm, ain't it always a but? Now, I heard free range. You can do whatever it is that you want to do. I keep telling y'all this shit over and over again. If you don't want to deal with somebody, you ain't got to deal with nobody, bro. If you want to be by yourself, you can do that. You know, people be, they be thinking that they fucking own you and shit. They be thinking that they have authority over your life and they the fuck don't the fuck. They don't. And nobody got authority over your life but you, bro. Straight up. You do what you want to fucking do. Most people are in situations to where they have to do what they have to do. Okay, here. Like, literally. Straight the fuck up, fam. That's what they feel. What's here? You definitely left someone. Or you, it, and it ain't even gotta be a, um, it ain't even gotta be a romantic relationship or anything like that. This could be family. You probably cut off some family members. You probably uh, cut off some friends. You probably left some job, something like that. But either way it goes, something here is just off. Yeah, rest and rejuvenation. You the boss. You are able to rest, okay? You got a new beginning here where the universe is not fucking with someone. They do not want you partnering with a, another individual because guess what? They're not strong enough. Whatever this is that you do, it requires spiritual strength. And they don't have it. They don't got the passion. Or maybe you just fell out of love with this damn person, bro. Or somebody told you that they ain't in love with you anymore. Yeah, they just were falling for temptation here. They were literally falling for temptation. I feel like this person could not control themselves in many different situations. I feel you've been very patient with this energy. But when you have to move forward, you have to move forward. And it be for your own betterment. Look, I can't make this up. Moving on. It be for your own betterment. It's not like, even if you're brokenhearted right now, trust and believe me, everything will be just fine. 
you have to walk away from certain people because God be having a blessing for you and he don't want them taking your shit or trying to take advantage of you. He knows the kind of heart you got, bro. For those of you all who are losing people, like when people are going out of your life, let them go. When you feel you need to walk away, walk the fuck away, bro. God be trying to show you who people are. God can give you so many signs, synch um, synch uh, signs and symbols. I was about to say synchronistic. <laughs> He gives us so many signs and symbols to make us aware of what the fuck is going on around us, bro. We don't pay attention sometimes, right? You have to remember to always be paying attention to what God's telling you. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Somebody thought that they were going to come towards you or something. They chose to come your way and, you know, they just got pushed way the fuck back right here by spirit. They thought that they were going to, you know, come in 555 and enjoy a blessing that God had for you. They, they, this person really has thought this through here. It's like, oh, they ain't scared because they ain't scared. a lot of y'all know the evil right here, bro. Y'all know how the evil are. It's like these people, you ain't scared to treat me like that. You, you ain't scared of what God gonna do to you right here. Okay. Somebody was being very deceptive and envious in a situation, but ain't that always the case? God does not want y'all around people that's going to drain your blessing is what the fuck I heard here. These people have no power. They're powerless against you. But, you know, like I said, when God is doing stuff, you have to listen to him. You have to use your wisdom, your discernment, and all that shit means same shit for real. You have to be wise in making choices because it's a gift here that God has for you and the things that he's blessing you with. He sees people that's trying to leech off his soul for whatever it is you got. He done heard shit. He done saw shit that you did. Like weird. They want to make up, but Spirit's saying, no, don't partner with these motherfucking people, bro. Somebody wants to, wants to talk to you after a breakup or you're literally about to leave this fucking person, bro. Okay, I think so, you know. You're literally about to leave this motherfucking person. Or you already did, and now they're growing impatient. They need to come around you now because they feel you got some kind of blessing coming. Emotional loss, like I said. Y'all definitely are going through some things in here, but it's okay. You know, you'll be just fine because it's something else here. It's something else that's growing and very rapidly, you know. And as I be telling y'all, too, these people be seeing y'all winning. That's why they try to come run in or they try to stick with you. Pussycat dog. The fuck? This person definitely um, left you or you left this person, period. Something is completely over. And it's not because you don't deserve anyone or, you know, you're supposed to be single forever. No. That's not what that means. It means that you have an unconditional love and God needs your heart to remain clean. God needs your heart to remain clean. Everybody ain't, everybody can't have all the shit that has happened to y'all and still hold unconditional love. Bro, y'all folk been through a lot of shit in this bitch. Y'all have been through a lot of motherfucking shit in this bitch. But see, the thing right here, Phil Masculine, you got to be discerning of, you know, who you're blessing. Who you're bringing into new things. You know, who you're sharing your ideas with. God is saying, this, some, something ain't right. So, yeah, you, you, I removed that person for you, for your betterment. Yeah, you need to walk away from this person from your, for your betterment. You need to definitely... Walk away from this person. And I also feel like, too, this person has a type. If they, you know, they have a type. Whoever this is, it's like they date people that look similar or something. Or this person could have even cheated on you with your own sister or something. Or your own brother right here, Masculine. A lot of a lot of relationships don't work just simply because motherfuckers don't put in the work for the shit to work. You gotta do the right shit for it to work. You keep doing the wrong shit, it ain't gonna never work, right? What else is here? A lot of y'all stood in your power in the situation, or you're about to definitely know your power. You might hear this motherfucker on the phone. You might hear somebody on the phone talking. 
Yeah, you know some. It's you know some shit, boy. You know some shit. You know some shit right here, Phil Master. You know something is over. That's just it is what the fuck it is. Yep, glimpse. You probably literally heard this person. You either heard something on the phone, ten ten, or you were literally in the house and they were on the phone and you were peeking around the corner or something. And if this ain't happened, it the fuck will. A lot of y'all are going to get the running. Literally, you're going to get the fuck on. This person has not changed. This person does not know who they are. They don't know what they're doing. God says, no, no, no more. No more of this relationship. No more of whatever the fuck this is. I feel like the most free, the freest you've ever been in this relationship is in your mind. You definitely meditate a lot. Yeah, motherfuckers is either moving or changing locks on their doors and shit right here. Straight up. Now you're manifesting and somebody wants to come out. They want to come back. No. And if you feel like somebody is not treating you right and they've been showing you indicators or whatever the fuck, you need to leave. God is like, no, I'm not gifting you anything until you get rid of these people. So I understand how breakups and stuff are, guys, but you have to look at it the spiritual way. Look at God way in it, you know. He's wanting you to detach and let go of, of, of shit that don't serve you, bro, literally. Walk away from shit that don't serve you. If you at a restaurant and your motherfucking waiter never comes to take your order, what are you going to do? You going to keep sitting there waiting? Or you going to call another motherfucking waitress? Or you going to leave the whole restaurant all together? They don't try to say right here, Phil Maskell. A lot of these folks do not be having the best intentions for you. They don't have any good intentions for you at all is what the fuck I heard. You don't need to know why people, you know, feel the way they do. I feel you should just always be focusing on yourself here, Phil Maskell. I don't play you. Because... You know, it's always going to be these kind of people in your life. Family, friends, people who you do business with. 1222, I saw it. it doesn't fucking matter. You have to always be in position for yourself to receive. Okay? Look. Somebody is definitely... Probably going to end up going to jail for something that they did, especially with this authority card. This is very sad because this is either where this person is going or that's where they are. And you couldn't go. What the fuck? God was not about to allow you to miss your blessing. What the hell? I told y'all, buddy, he told me want you to go through their karma with them, bruh. They be wanting you to go through this shit with them. They courthouse situations. Like, if you're married or whatever, cool. But this kind of person, man, hell nah, bro. This person is definitely a hindrance to everything that you're doing. But they're purposely doing it. Purposely draining you, taking from you. Straight up, bro. God don't be wanting these kind of people around us, bro. God knows exactly what he's doing. Okay, this person definitely you walked away from them or you're about to. A lot of y'all be in karmic cycles and don't even know it because you be loyal to motherfuckers, bro. Everybody don't deserve your loyalty, bro. I heard unconditional love. Something's just going horribly fucking wrong here. I feel like you might get this news of this person literally after y'all break up or you might have just heard about it. Okay. You could have a child with this person. It doesn't matter. And I'm not saying fuck people, fuck that, fuck that bitch. No. Fuck anybody who got ill intentions towards you. When they know goddamn well the only reason why they coming towards you is for a specific thing. Man, hell no, nah, bro. That's not how that's not how that goes. That's not how you treat people, bro. And God knows your heart. That's why you're always receiving some kind of unexpected income. God knows your heart, bro, because you you get blessed and you bless others, bro. And that's exactly why you rank so fucking high. Okay? 
somebody just can't go with you, they may be mad on fucking well, bro. Go to anger management. The fuck wrong with you? Go talk to somebody. Who cares? <laughs> These folks be on fuck shit the whole goddamn time until they see you got something coming in for you and then they're expecting it for them. I always count y'all fucking pockets, bro. Counting your blessings for you. And then trying to go in and fucking block some shit for you. Community. This person be in the community making kids with everybody and they got down daddy. Everybody and they got down mama right here. Like I said, everybody they got down daddy. Everybody they got down mama. So this is divine them and masculine who done broke up with somebody. I'm just telling you what fuck this person be on, bro. This main male in the reverse, this main female in the reverse, these kind of people, bro, will literally drag you down, bro. I heard a crab in a bucket. Crab in a bucket, in a barrel, in a box, in a bowl. I don't give a fuck. They crab. Crusty fucking crabs. Oh, Ultimately, though, I do want to say that it's, it's truly up to you. Okay? God gonna bless you. What you do with it, that's truly up to you. It could be a marriage here. Someone's getting a divorce or something. I don't damn know if they're messing. God has been literally training you for these moments. Keep no one the fuck around you, bro, who is not there. Straight the fuck up. This could be somebody you're married to, you're dating. I don't know. They want to just come back because you got something here for you. This is an ex. If you have not broken up with your husband, wife, boyfriend, or girlfriend, I'm not talking about you. And maybe I am too because I feel like some shit needs to be dismantled in this energy as well. Somebody definitely is here um, and they're not a good influence. They're not a good influence, bro. Yeah, thief. Privileged lady. Still in front of privileged lady. Energy. Trying to make you miss out on opportunities here. You will never be in poverty. That's what I do want to say as well here for that aspect. And this motherfucker ain't gonna be able to steal shit. It's all about that sin. We're all about this blessing. That God has bestowed upon your life. Look, bro, I cannot ever make this up. Gift and great fortune. But these folk be knowing what the fuck going on. Bro, I'm saying, bro these folk be knowing what's going on, fam. Masculine. They know, bro. But these folk be all up in y'all damn baby. All the time. If you think these motherfuckers don't down there know something good, they may not know exactly what it is, but they know something. Well, look, it's an ending to a home situation here. And I also feel like, too, a lot of you all are about to be gifted a home. Someone passed away and left you at home. You may already know about this for investment. Because I was picking up on some movers earlier. Um... It's really, bro, it's really sad, I do want to say. Bad, man, these 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 people know damn well they they fuck up every goddamn thing and then they want to come kiss your ass when you got something here, bro. A lot of damn stopping through tarot or just trying to 
keep up with your family to see what your bitch said. This person might be going through your family and all kind of shit, right? Learn about what you doing, your family talking down bad on you and shit right here. They all sitting back stalking your social fucking media and shit. Stealing and shit. Motherfuckers is crazy as hell, bro. This shit is crazy to me. Straight up. Y'all folks is having wish fulfillment. That's why these people are not liking what's going on. You have to leave someone behind or you already did, bro. You have to leave someone uh, behind or you have already left. And that's what you were supposed to do, okay? Yeah. You were supposed to end something. Or you are. You will be prompted to. Oh, trust that. Spirit so gonna let you know. You, oh, no, 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 no. You can't stay here. Yep. I can never make no shit like this up. The world card and the death card. Wow. I can never make that up. Scorpio energy. Something is over. Something is completely fucking over, okay? Because God said, no, no, nah, man, hell no, nah, bro. I'm not really had enough of you too, divine man, I said. I'm ready to bless you with this here. You need to get the fuck out of the way of these people, karma, because they ask for getting karma. If you want to get hit with the karma too, then stay. Three of Pentacles, two of Pentacles. They want to work with you now because they don't want to juggle. They don't, they want to be, um, I heard stable. <laughs> Y'all be smarter than that. I'm telling you, you got somebody that's coming back. You know exactly. You don't want to try to say right here, Fair Master. Two of Swords in reverse. Bro, you know exactly what the fuck going on. And you gonna know exactly what to do when you find out what's going on. Okay, here. Whatever this blessing is, God is granting you. Whatever this is, God is doing in your life. If you're not already aware of it, you will be. But you did not miss any opportunities. You passed the test, as I heard. I heard with flying colors. You passed the test with flying colors. That's confetti. Straight the fuck up. Straight the fuck up right here, Phil Master. I'm very proud of you all, bro. What else is here, daddy? What's the best part? Thank you. Yeah. Come on, fuckers. People refuse to see things from a different perspective, from a different angle. You know, they 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 don't want to look at the shit and have your how you would feel about something or how something would affect you into consideration. These people will hold you back, bro. I'm telling you. And God is saying hold back. From motherfuckers. It's a huge blessing on the way to you. Always be evaluating you though with this four of pentacles. I'm seeing self-introspection. Always make sure that you are definitely in alignment. In any kind of situation, no matter who's trying to bring what kind of low vibration towards you, make sure because it won't touch you. You're about to be celebrating here. You're very victorious all of the fucking time. Can't nobody tend towards you. When you're already healed, the fuck? STD people think you're stupid, bro. People be thinking you're dumb. You're not dumb at all, bro. There is nothing slow about you, bro. Star card. A lot of healing. These people need to do some healing. And you're also still healing as well. Just keep healing, bro. Keep healing. You've already healed from whatever betrayal this is. But just keep healing. Star card, hermit. Aquarius, Virgo, judgment at the bottom here with the Eight of Pentacles. You're being judged for the shit that you work on. You've done so many good things, bro. God is literally handing you something. And you don't have to wait long for it. But he definitely wants you to get rid of somebody or some people. You have to walk away from something. I'm just telling you, bro. You got to walk away from things. From people who going to always have you in some kind of third party. Some shit that ain't got anything to fucking do with you the fuck. This shit, I times out of 10, I have nothing to do with y'all, bro. And you have new love here, too. You're already with somebody new. Fuck it is. Straight the fuck up. What else is here? Thank you. Yeah. You walked away, or you have to. 
It's for your own betterment, though. I promise you that. God is not about to let nobody use you. I don't give a fuck who they are to you. Like I said, he saw some things. He heard some things. Okay, here. Yep. What did I just say? He saw some things. He heard some things. Page of Swords. Page of Swords. <laughs> These motherfuckers be watching y'all to come in and do some kind of shit to get a reaction out of you. Look, I don't even know how the fuck that happened. This is a never ending story, is what I feel like. Look, Queen of Wands. Because you're creating shit, bro. And you are more creative than you've ever been here, fam, my son. Somebody's hitting under the moon. Look, this fucking five of wands. I saw this the fucking truth. Somebody trying to motherfucking bring confidence to the goddamn Empress, Queen of Cups. Somebody wants you to fully let your guard down and trust them. Oh, bro, this person can't be trusted. Look, Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. In the sun energy. And somebody is trying to bring an imbalance to you. It could be a sage here. Oh, boy. Leo. This motherfucker is trying to bring an imbalance to the Empress. What? The fuck? Is this with your broke ass? That's what I'm talking to your broke ass. This is a fucking narcissist. They're a liar. Whoever the fuck this King of Swords in the reverse is, they're a liar, a manipulator. Hell, all this shit means the same shit. Truly, it does. Truly, it does, Phil Messman. They don't know. I say two, six, five, six, seven down swords with a magician, dude. We know that, right? We know that, right? This is that sneaky behavior that they have. We know this. We. Make a decision. Love you first. We. Because if you have walked away from someone, trust me, God has something for you. If you're needing to walk away from someone, trust me, you need to talk to God. He will guide you on how. But I'm telling you, it's 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 a season of medicine. Supernatural blessings here. Prophecies and shit happening right now. You gotta make sure that your shit is not in vain. Or in jeopardy is what I wanted to say. Okay. You have to make sure you got that line of God open, bro, all the time so he can definitely be able to get your attention when he needs to, bro. Straight up, because it's always something that he needs us to know when we're winning like this, okay? This is a blessing that you will not see coming. But this person, I'm telling you, they're coming. Or you need to walk away from them, okay? If you do not walk away from this person, you will definitely be drained out of your blessing. They're solely coming in to drain your blessing. Now that you, you know, are in this position of authority or point. All right, you guys. Make sure you all are subscribing. Okay, leave comments. Let me know when these messages resonate for y'all. Like, share, okay? And remember, God loves you. And so do I. I'll see you later.